We're outside the uh, Royal Goat uh, Hotel in Beth Gilead. Me and Jackie were just discussing the, uh, the unusualness of the name. Then it came to mind regarding the Welsh Fusiliers, the mascot, the goat. It's, it's a very dear animal to this country, so I, I'm sure that that's, that's the connection. But what a beautiful um, stroll we've had around Beth Gilead. Jack, haven't we? Yeah. I think we can agree um, and uh, we'd recommend it to anybody who's in the Snowdonia National Park yeah, to uh, we are coming back yeah we decided to uh, have a day of it we've we discovered uh, two two interesting walks that'll take us um, to the higher one definitely will take us to the higher ground and we'll be able to get a, a good um, overall view of the of the little town which is always a good thing. We tend to do that. We did it in Dog Ethley, we did it in Bala, we did it in Langothlin, and I always find it's a good perspective on um, finding your, your whereabouts and, and seeing a scope. And especially where sometimes a, a town, the industry as well, you can see the um, the landmarks. And, is it, Jack? Yeah. Especially yeah. the slate mining, obviously around here, coal mining. Um, steelworks any gold mining even in the dog Ethley area um yeah and it always leaves its scars on the landscape as we found out jack haven't we yeah we have but uh, we're living and learning all the time and uh, it's the great thing about being on the open road is we're able to uh, learn something new every day oh, you've I, learned I think. something new coming back to Beth Gallon. we have indeed you, said you hadn't noticed how high the mountains were i hadn't no no, no. And i certainly hadn't visited the railway station Oh, right. okay. which uh, sure. is a definitely a win it's a win-win yeah. Jack isn't it yeah. so we'll catch you all later yeah. happy travels peace and love all the way <laughs>